Michelangelo mocked the clergy who criticized his drawings. Michelangelo Buonarroti was a very famous artist and sculptor who received recognition during his lifetime. Why, he was so cool that the Pope personally invited him to paint the Sistine Chapel. The painter enthusiastically took up his favorite task, painting beautiful naked bodies in the strangest positions. And the pontiff liked it. But among those close to the Pope there were also those who believed that naked people in the Vatican were no longer acceptable. The shameless man could at least draw underpants for them. But he, you see, doesn't want to. No decency or humility before the Lord. The main opponent of nudity in the chapel was the papal master of ceremonies Biagio de Sassina, not the last person in the circle of his holiness. Having seen Michelangelo working on the Last Judgment fresco, he stated the following. How shameful that in such a sacred place all these naked figures should be depicted, so shamefully exposing themselves. This fresco is more suitable for public baths and taverns than for a papal chapel. Biagio Martinelli de Sassina Papal Master of Ceremonies Michelangelo took it and silently added Biagio to the fresco. He depicted him in the underworld, surrounded by demons and frightened sinners, in the guise of Minus, an infernal judge with donkey ears. The body of the Master of Ceremonies was wrapped around a snake, sinking its teeth into his penis. Biagio began to be indignant to Dad, what does this painter allow himself to do? To which the pontiff laconically replied that he is God's vicegerent on earth, and his power does not extend to hell, so the portrait must remain. Later, at the Council of Triden, churchmen reconsidered their views on nudity in art and decided, no, after all, it's not good to appear in church without pants. By order of the new Pope Pius IV, the artist Daniele de Volterra, a student of Michelangelo, made some changes to the fresco, adding loincloths to everyone. Because of this, he received the nickname Bragatone, Drawer of Pants. In addition, he remade Saint Catherine and Blaise of Sebastian depicted there. Mischievous Michelangelo painted the first completely naked, and the second, looking at her butt. The clergy decided that the lady should be dressed, and the saint should be turned towards the heavenly throne. And to portray on his face not carnal interest, but exclusively piety.